Welcome. This webinar is intended for indie girls, their parents, and service unit cookie managers. First, we will be giving a general overview of the cookie program, and then we will talk about some indie specific details. Just a quick note, eBuddy, the cookie management website, considers indie girls as their own troop, so you may hear us say indie girl scout and troop interchangeably. Generations of girls have built the cookie program into a beloved tradition and the largest girl-led entrepreneurship program in the world. Our Girl Scouts aren't just selling Girl Scout cookies, they're doing their part to make their communities better places as they prepare for successful futures. My name is Debbie Hazlett, Administrative Assistant, Product Sales. If you have any questions during the cookie program, I am here to help. I can be contacted by email or by phone. My number is 1-800-248-3355. My business hours are 8.30 a.m. to 5 p.m. Monday through Thursday and 9 a.m. to noon on Friday. Cookie Bites is a GSWPA e-newsletter with helpful hints and to-do reminders for all eBuddy users. It's the best way to get the up-to-the-minute information on the cookie program. As an indie parent, you will receive the cookie bites. Please be sure to check your junk mail if you are not receiving information from cookie bites. Please don't unsubscribe from any GSWPA or eBuddy emails or you'll miss essential information. If you accidentally unsubscribe from cookie bites or emails generated through eBuddy, you can re-subscribe through the Contacts tab in eBuddy. A very special cookie season is ahead of us. Well before Girl Scout cookies were produced by licensed bakers to sell nationally, Girl Scouts baked and sold cookies on their own. Our girls were entrepreneurs going as far back as 1917. We're celebrating 100 years of Girl Scouts selling cookies. That's 100 years of learning and leading, of creating and succeeding. There's no end to what girls can build with the Girl Scout Cookie Program. This year's cookie program is titled Built by Girls to honor the 100th anniversary of Girl Scouts selling cookies. And sharing OWL, the cookie fun, is this year's theme, mascot, Twyla, and her mom, Twilight. Here are some important dates for you to remember. The cookie program starts January 6th. Permission slips are due to your service unit cookie manager before your indie starts to sell. Girl Scouts start selling cookies January 6th. Booth scheduler opens January 12th. Girls initial orders are due in eBuddy on January 27th. If you need assistance, please speak to your service unit cookie manager or call during the council helpline hours. Cookie deliveries take place from February 15th through the 23rd. National Girl Scout Cookie Weekend is happening February 24th to the 26th. Booth sales open February 24th and run through March 19th. Final recognition orders are due in eBuddy by March 25th and indie payments are due to the council by March 30th. Your service unit cookie manager is your local contact for the cookie program. Your service unit cookie manager is there to help guide you and your Girl Scout through the cookie program and answer questions. You can get your Girl Scouts cookie materials from the service unit cookie manager or contact me, Debbie Hazlett. The materials in the packet include the family guide and permission form, the girl order card, a money envelope, and a goal getter order card. If your Girl Scout needs more than one order card, she can use the goal getter order card as additional order cards. You can get as many goal getter cards as you need. Our cookies are on a mission to help girls learn five skills that are essential to leadership, to success and to life. She's also building lifelong skills, friendships, and confidence along the way. Girls will learn how to set goals, whether it's a pizza party, a community project, or the first overnight camping trip with her service unit. 
She knows how many cookies she needs to sell to make that happen. Girls will hone their decision-making skills by deciding where and when to sell cookies, how to market their sale, and what to do with their rewards. Girls will advance their money management skills by making a budget, taking cookie orders, and handling customers' money. Girls will refine their people skills by learning how to talk and listen to their customers. And girls will develop business ethics by acting honestly and responsibly during every step of the cookie program. In addition to the five skills, girls can earn badges that enhance the financial literacy aspect of the cookie program. Each adds a new twist in an age-appropriate way and most importantly gets them thinking, learning, and having fun through cookies. Girl Scouting provides girls with precious lifelong experiences and values. The Girl Scout Cookie Program is a key part of that experience. The Cookie Program is essential to GSWPA's mission of building girls of courage, confidence, and character. Funds raised through the Cookie Program support many aspects of Girl Scouting by providing Indies with program rewards to fund their Girl Scout activities, keeping camp affordable by subsidizing registration costs, supporting the Girl Scout experience by providing girl programming, curriculum, and events, providing scholarships to girls with financial barriers so Girl Scouting is available to all, and providing girls the opportunity to earn fun recognitions. Eight varieties are offered on this year's order card. The six traditional varieties, Thin Mint, Samoa, Tagalong, Trefoil, Dosido, -Do, and Savannah Smiles are sold to customers for $4 per box. The two specialty cookies, S'mores and Toffee Tastic, are sold to customers at $5 per box. Girl Scouts are famous for making s'mores and now there's a specialty s'mores cookie to help celebrate the 100th anniversary of Girl Scouts selling cookies. Girl Scouts s'mores from Little Brownie Baker are on trend with today's cookie consumers looking for a delicious cookie made with simple natural ingredients. A truly perfect fit with Girl Scouting. Girl Scout s'mores are crunchy graham sandwich cookies with creamy chocolate and marshmallowy filling. Created exclusively for Girl Scouts, our custom-designed s'mores cookie promotes Girl Scouting's new Girls' Choice badges that showcase outdoor education experiences for girls. We know once you try them, you'll want some more! Created exclusively for Girl Scouts, our custom-designed s'mores cookie promotes Girl Scouting's new Girls' Choice badge that showcases outdoor education experiences for girls. We know once you'll try them, you'll want s'more. S'mores and Toffee Tastics are limited production cookies and may not be available in cookie cupboards. Therefore, we suggest if any indie girl wants to have s'mores and Toffee Tastic at their booth sales or for additional customer orders, the parent should place an order for these varieties with the initial order. Reminder, cookies cannot be returned or exchanged if you order too many, but if you do order too many, you can check with the service unit to see if anyone needs them. A troop-to-troop -troop transfer will need to occur in eBuddy. Indies can use cookie cupboards to get additional cookies or to exchange damaged product. They're located throughout the council at select GSWPA offices and volunteers' homes, so you have easy access to additional cookies. Find a complete list of cookie cupboards on eBuddy under the Reports tab and Cupboards. We will consolidate the number of cupboards throughout the sale by moving cookies to well-used locations. The cupboard report automatically updates when cupboards open or close. Indies must place a pending order through eBuddy on the Transactions tab to the cupboard for additional cookies. Indies can take full cases or single packages from a cookie cupboard. No cases or packages will be exchanged for a different variety. Please note, there's a limited availability of Savannah Smiles, S'mores, and Toffee Tastic at cookie cupboards. 
Because IRS regulations do not allow a girl to keep dollar for dollar proceeds like a troop, Indie Girls earned program rewards for participating in the 2017 cookie program. Girl Scout Program Rewards is a system designed specifically for Indie Girls in which their earned proceeds are calculated and returned to the Indie Girl in the form of program rewards. For the cookie program, Indie Girls will earn program rewards based on a box range formula. We've reviewed many options and with the best interest of the girl in mind, we came to the decision of creating the box band to get as close as we could without breaking IRS regulations. In order to receive the first credit, a girl must sell at least 10 boxes. Girl Scout program rewards are mailed to the girls and arrive in $5 increments. The program rewards will be accompanied by the redemption instructions, so please keep this in a safe place. Program rewards that are lost cannot be replaced. They have a business card likeness, are non-transferable, and expire three years from the date of issue. Rewards can be used for a number of things. They can be used for council-sponsored events and programming, resident camp sessions, council shop purchases, service unit day camp and events, and annual Girl Scout membership. Change is not given if a program reward is not used in its entirety. Program rewards cannot be used for online purchases or orders within our online registration system and therefore must be processed in-house. Girls must be registered Girl Scouts to use them and rewards must be used before the girl transitions to adult status. Along with the five skills girls develop through the cookie program and rewards earned, girls earn individual recognitions for their efforts. They can choose between specific items or Girl Scout bucks at select levels. If a Girl Scout sells 600 or more boxes of cookies, she'll receive the Super Seller exclusive invite to rock the boat with other swashbucklers at the Spring 2017 Super Seller Celebration aboard the Gateway Clipper in Pittsburgh or the Victorian Princess in Erie. The reservations have not been confirmed yet, but the parties will be in late May or early June. We think this year's recognitions are owl good. You can review these recognitions on the back of the cookie order card or family guide. Initial recognitions are awarded to girls that sell 160 and 210 packages on their initial order card. Initial orders are due in eBuddy by January 27th. Every girl selling 160 packages earns the Cookie Power Padfolio Clipboard. At 210 packages, she also earns the Cookie Love Crossbody Bag. Initial orders must be placed in full cases just as a troop would. Additional boxes can be picked up at your local cookie cupboards. If your indie sells 13 Thin Mint but you do not want to order another full case, you may enter one case into eBuddy and get the extra box at a cupboard. Please note that additional packages picked up at the cookie cupboard do not count towards initial recognitions. Not only do girls have lots of fun creating their own web pages and marketing their sales online through Digital Cookie, girls can also earn recognitions for selling cookies through Digital Cookie. Girls earn the Cookie Techie Patch when they sell 25 packages through Digital Cookie. 
Girls earn the s'mores charm when they sell 50 packages through Digital Cookie. And girls earn a $25 Amazon gift card when they sell 100 packages through Digital Cookie. At select levels, girls can choose Girl Scout bucks instead of the recognitions. Girls can use them as payment toward any GSWPA sponsored camp or service unit day camp. At camp trading posts and GSWPA shops. For council events and programs. And for annual membership fees processed through GSWPA. Remember, Girl Scout bucks are doubled when used towards a GSWPA sponsored camp. Indies can also earn the Super Troop rewards by selling 160 and 175 packages. When Indies reach 160 packages or more, she receives a Super Troop t-shirt. If your Indie earns one, additional volunteer t-shirts will be available for purchase. The order form will be available through Cookie Bites. Indies who sell 175 packages earn additional rewards based on the box range scale. Junior, Cadet, Senior, and Ambassador Indies can opt out of receiving individual recognitions and earn additional program rewards for packages sold. If an Indie decides to decline recognitions, she will need to complete the opt-out form and turn it in to her Service Unit Cookie Manager. Indies opting out of recognitions will still receive all patches, the initial recognitions, the Super Troop t-shirt, and any of the 1,000 package level and above recognitions if earned. To decline recognitions and receive additional proceeds, submit the opt-out form found on the VIPE training site to your Service Unit Cookie Manager. Check the Opt Out for Additional Proceeds box on the Setting tab in eBuddy and allocate cookies to the Indie on the Girl Orders tab because remember, she will still earn patches, initial recognitions, the Super Troop t-shirt, and any of the 1,000 package level and above recognitions if earned. If your Indie is new to the cookie program, there's a fun 10-minute video to help them understand the basics. Girls learn how the sale works, cookie names, easy ways to ask a customer to buy, cookie booth essentials, safety rules, and how to set goals. Show the 10-minute video and discuss it afterwards, or stop after each section for the discussion and activities. It's up to you and the girls. Find the video on the Little Brownie YouTube channel or on our website. More information can be found at littlebrowniebakers.com under Activities. A Cookie Rookie patch is available for purchase at GSWPA shops. There are no requirements to purchase this patch. eBuddy is the online cookie management system provided by our licensed baker, Little Brownie Bakers. This is where Indies place their initial order, track cookie packages, record cookie transactions, and select girl recognition items. Because of the way eBuddy works, Indie girls are considered their own troop. If you are comfortable with using eBuddy, you can have your service unit cookie manager add you as a troop user. If you are not, you can give your order to your service unit cookie manager and she can help enter it for you. We will also have an Indie Family Helpline Day 
where an Indy parent can call the office and speak to a staff member to enter the Indy cookie order. For all users to log into eBuddy, visit ebuddy.littlebrownie.com. Your username is your email address, and your new temporary password is dosi at 2992. This temporary password is for everyone, both new and returning users. Password is case sensitive, so be sure to enter it as you see. After logging in for the first time, if a user wants to change their email address or reset their password, it can be done on the login screen. Please note that only the user can change their email address. Cookie VIP eTraining is where Cookie volunteers learn step by step what they need to know about the Cookie program. This site is only accessible to those volunteers that are eBuddy users. Sections 1 through 4 provide great information on program materials, marketing ideas, technology opportunities, and the cookies. These sections have tons of great information. In Section 5, you'll find GSWPA specific information, including forms and helpful resources to help you during the sale. Because this site is restricted to eBuddy users, it has the most comprehensive list of GSWPA cookie forms. In the OSA Operation Sweet Appreciation Program, GSWPA cookie customers purchase cookies for $4 per box to donate to our U.S. military, active duty, and veteran service member organizations. Girl Scout troops never take physical possession of these cookies. These cookies are delivered to support organizations directly from the bakery and GSWPA. Last year, GSWPA customers donated more than 43,000 packages of cookies through Operation Sweet Appreciation. An Operation Sweet Appreciation patch is available for purchase in GSWPA shops. There are no requirements to purchase this patch. Does your Indy already have the OSA patch? This year, girls can add a star patch placed next to the OSA patch to signify each year they participated in OSA. Star patches are available for purchase in GSWPA shops. In the Troop Gift of Caring program, troops make a donation of Girl Scout cookies from their troop inventory to a worthy organization such as a local food pantry, shelter, care center, hospital, or any other deserving organization. GSWPA encourages troops to learn about the organization that receives the troops' gift of caring to truly provide the girls with a full community experience. Indies also have the opportunity to participate in this optional program. Customers can donate $4 for a gift of caring box and girls can indicate those donations on the order card. Last year, over 15,500 packages were donated through the Troop Gift of Caring program. A Gift of Caring patch is available for purchase in GSWPA shops. There are no requirements to purchase this patch. The 5 for 5 contests help girls exceed their goals. When taking individual orders and making sales at cookie booths, Ask Girl Scout cookie lovers to purchase five packages of cookies to participate in a drawing to win five cases of their favorite Girl Scout cookies. Last year, we received more than 10,000 entries. The 5 for 5 promotion runs the entire sale, January 6th through March 19th. For every five packages purchased, customers can enter at gswpa.org slash five for five to win five cases of cookies. Indies can print their supply of five for five entry forms to give to customers. Entry forms are sent as an attachment in Cookie Bites or can be downloaded from vipetraining.littlebrownie.com. The drawing will be held in April 2017. This is a GSWPA-wide drawing and five winners will be selected and announced online at gswpa.org. 
With Digital Cookie, the Girl Scout Cookie Program girls know and love is now better than ever. Now there are more ways for girls to sell, more ways for customers to buy, and more ways for girls to learn and have a ton of fun. With Digital Cookie, each girl can use technology to share her cookie story, earn recognitions, access cookie business badges online, track customer info, order, and data, send cool, ready-to-use marketing emails, play games, watch videos, and enjoy printable activities. They can also use their smart goal-setting calculator and make it easy for friends and family near and far to get their favorite Girl Scout cookies. Participation is easy. To sign up to use the Digital Cookie platform, just keep an eye out for a registration email coming to you just before Christmas. It will come from the Girl Scout Cookie Program email at email.girlscouts.org with the subject Ready, Set, Register for Digital Cookie. Be sure to check your junk or spam boxes to make sure you don't miss it. In just a few minutes, a girl can set up her sale goal, share her cookie story, and upload a fun picture. Then she's ready to save, review, publish, and done. All girls selling cookies online should follow GSUSA's guidelines for online marketing. Girls can market cookies by sending emails to friends, family members, and former customers. Girls' full names, addresses, and email addresses should never be given out to customers. An indie should use a group contact number or email address overseen by an adult for customers to request information, reorder, or give comments. Girls age 13 and older can use social networking sites that are closed communities, such as Facebook, that do not have a shopping cart to market cookies. Sales may not occur online outside of Digital Cookie. Sites that have an electronic shopping cart, online auction function, or public sale sites such as eBay or Craigslist are prohibited. GSWPA uses three types of delivery. Traditional delivery, such as a church or fire hall, count and go delivery, and warehouse delivery. Check with your service unit cookie manager to see which delivery type your service unit participates in and for information on your delivery date and time. Initial orders will be delivered February 15th through the 23rd, 2017. Any adult can pick up cookies at a delivery site for an Indy. The adult must count the Indy order and sign before leaving the delivery site. If the adult picking up is someone other than the adult listed in eBuddy, please contact the service unit cookie manager to make them aware of who will be arriving for delivery. GSWPA will join other Girl Scout councils across the country February 24th through the 26th to participate in National Girl Scout Cookie Weekend 2017, celebrating all the fun, learning and excitement Girl Scouts have experienced selling cookies for 100 years. This special weekend is also the start of GSWPA's booth sales. It's a great way to share the news about the Girl Scout cookie program. Booth sales are a great way to increase your indie success. These are sites where girls sell their product to customers in a face-to-face -face transaction. Typically booths are outside of retail establishments on weekends. Booth sales can be scheduled February 24th through March 19th. All Girl Scout grade levels, daisies through ambassadors, can participate in booth sales. Only one adult is required at all cookie booths for Indies. Contact your service unit cookie manager for available sites. Cookie booth patches are available for purchase at GSWPA shops. There are no requirements to purchase this patch for girls. The GSWPA Bling Your Booth Challenge is open to all troops and indies in GSWPA. Indies may submit one photo by visiting gswpa.org bling and completing the entry form. 
The deadline to enter is Sunday, March 26th at 11.59 p.m. Be sure to have a photo release for the girl picture and include promotion of the five skills, five for five customer contest, Operation Sweet Appreciation, and your Indie Cookie Goals. Photo entries will be posted to the GSWPA Facebook page at facebook.com slash GSWPA the week of March 27th, and voting will be open for one week after the photos are posted. Friends, family, and cookie customers can vote for your booth by liking your photo on our page. The three photos receiving the most likes will win. Winning photos will be featured on our website and three lucky winners will receive a GSWPA shop certificate. Accepting checks from customers for cookie payment is a parent decision. If an indie parent decides to accept personal checks for cookie payments, checks should be made payable to the indie parent and deposited in their personal bank account in a timely manner. If a customer's check is returned for insufficient funds, the parent will incur any fees assessed by the bank. GSWPA will not reimburse for NSF fees. Because indie girls do not keep any proceeds and are exempt from ACH, parents must mail a check or money order for the total amount to GSWPA, Attention Debbie Hazlett, 612 Locust Street, Johnstown, PA, 15901. Please refer to the Troop Total Sales Amount on the Sales Report tab in eBuddy for the total amount due. Money is due by March 30th. Still have questions? Your first contact for general questions about the cookie program is the Service Unit Cookie Manager. If you do not know who your Service Unit Cookie Manager is, please contact Customer Care at 1-800-248-3355. Be sure to read and refer back to Cookie Bytes. Most answers to your questions can be found there. If your Service Unit Cookie Manager cannot answer your question and you did not find the answer in Cookie Bytes, please contact Customer Care. All incoming phone calls to GSWPA are routed through to the Customer Care Specialist. These staff members are here to help and can answer most technical questions. If you prefer to email, please email the Customer Care address with basic questions. The Customer Care Specialist can respond quicker and are eager to help. If you have a more complex question or issue, you can contact a member of the product sales team directly. Indies can do amazing things with cookie rewards. Post your Indies fun and exciting cookie experiences to our Indie Rally. Share your Indie cookie success stories and pictures and amazing things she has done with her rewards with other Indies. Thank you for taking the time to watch this Indie Cookie training video to help make the cookie program successful for your Indie.